Hello and welcome to Glen ZB TV for Thursday, the show that puts Glen ZB up your periscope. I'm bringing New Zealand to the world and the world to New Zealand. And September 23rd is uh, quite the momentous date to have an election on, isn't it? Of course, uh, we all know it's Bruce Springsteen's birthday, uh, Ray Charles's birthday as well, although he probably won't be celebrating it this year. Uh, John Lennon. Uh, got together with Yoko Ono, I think, on this day in 1969. And so I don't know if that was cause for celebration or not. That's September 23rd, I mean, not this day, today. Rob Waddell. Rower, New Zealand rower. Won gold at the Sydney Olympics in the year 2000. So, um, yep. I'm not quite sure what, what all that has to do with our election, but, you know, it's interesting. And given that we don't do Today in History on the Mike Hosking Breakfast anymore, it's a nice, nice little callback for those of you who remember that. Ah, Russia. Two former cybersecurity officers from Russia's Federal Security Service have been charged with treason. And an employee of a cybersecurity firm has also been charged. Uh, they've been, they've all been charged with state treason in the interests of the United States. Uh, I just can't help thinking that this is, this is a bit ironic, given allegations of Russian hacking in the new the United States election. So, I mean, everybody's doing it. Anyway, see what happens there. Uh, this is a real uh, old school fundraising idea. Uh, n n sorry, did you see that here like that? Uh, we're not fundraising to save an old school. I mean, it's this is a fundraising idea that's old school. That's not why I did that. Uh, new Zealanders are being urged to get behind a campaign to protect wetlands and not just for our birds and wildlife uh, fish and game has today launched a special fundraising stamp oh no bruce has just pointed out that if i'm gonna go old school i need to spell it with a k no not a ch again ironic that you have to misspell school when you're being old school anyway uh, yes, yeah, so uh, World Wetlands Day. I'm presuming that must be today. Uh, they, they, they've launched a fundraising stamp. Variations of the stamp are available from New Zealand Post and start at $10. Do you reckon that's going to go gangbusters? A fundraising stamp. Do we, people even know what stamps are anymore? You don't have to stick a stamp on an email. I suppose the, the kind of people who are interested in the birds that are in the wetlands. Uh, anyway, good luck with that. Finally, parking can be tricky. Uh, most of my accidents have uh, happened immediately before or after parking. Uh, backing out causes me issues, that's for sure. Sometimes backing in. Backing generally. I'm not a fan. I'm more of an angle parker than a parallel parker. Otago police are investigating a dangerous parking manoeuvre that left a woman injured and pinned against a fence. Uh, a car driven by a 40-year-old man was parking in an angle near the Arrowtown Skateboard Park when the car trapped the 35-year-old for a few seconds yesterday. Now, I think we can make fun of this uh, because the woman was taken to hospital but her injuries weren't serious. Um, but I also feel like maybe skate, uh, skateboarder was involved in this given that it was adjacent to a skateboarder park. But I think it is fair to say that if uh, 
during the process of parking, you pin somebody against a fence, you're probably doing it wrong. That'd be my advice. So you just, while you're parking, if you've pinned somebody up against something, you've gone a bit close. That's all I'm saying. I am Glenn ZB. Do take notice of your proximity detector alarms, and I will see you back here again tomorrow. Thanks for having me up your periscope.